It sounds like Leslie Headland, director of The Acolyte, wants to create a Knights of the Old Republic live action show. Yes, in an interview with Amalit, Leslie Headland revealed that she wanted to make a Knights of the Old Republic live action series, and that she's particularly interested in Kreia, one of the main characters from Knights of the Old Republic 2. She shares the following quote, I've always wanted to explore a live action version of the Knights of the Old Republic game and Kreia's character. I think it would be a really interesting story to bring to life. So yeah, just general blanket statement. Sounds like Leslie is very much wanting to do a KOTOR series. And this actually makes a lot of sense. If you look on my channel, there are several videos of her saying she's a fan of the Knights of Old Republic games. She really likes Darth Treya, that she was inspired by Knights of the Old Republic for the Acolyte. The list goes on and on. So it only makes sense that she would want to just go ahead and just make that show. Now we get into the weird discussion of this topic, is if this should happen and if she should be the head of it. One, I 100% think this should happen. This is exactly what fans want and what they have wanted forever. Whenever a bad project comes out, all you hear is, we just want Old Republic. We just want live action Old Republic. So a live action Old Republic series or movie trilogy 100% needs to happen at some point in the near future. Now, is Leslie Headland the right choice for it? Personally, I have enjoyed The Acolyte so far. I know that is a very hot take, but I have enjoyed it so far. There are things I obviously don't like about it that she brings to the table, of course, that I would not want in a Knights of the Old Republic series. Please, God, no. But overall, her directing is pretty solid. However, the only way I would want her to be at the head of this project is if she hears the criticisms from the Acolyte and completely shifts the narrative. Because the general consensus of the Acolyte is people don't like it, they don't like her direction of it, and I get that. And we can't have that in such a beloved legend story. The Acolyte is one thing, we don't know these characters, it's very removed from the timeline, but Knights of the Old Republic is something people have been waiting for forever to see in live action. So she's really gotta put a lot of her politics on the back burner and just focus on telling a good story and take criticisms from the Acolyte on the shoulder and improve moving forward. Now, do I think she's going to get this? I 100% believe that this is going to happen. Kathleen Kennedy, everybody who's in charge at Lucasfilm, seems to really speak highly of Leslie Headland. Whether you like her or not personally, she seems to be one of the front runners at Lucasfilm to potentially make more projects. So now her going on the record and saying this in the public, I think they may put her on for this sometime soon. So if you are a Leslie hater or Leslie lover, just be on the lookout for that, I guess. But yeah, that is really all I have to say about that news. Just a small little comment from Leslie Headland saying that she would like very much to direct a Knights of the Old Republic show. I want to know what you guys have to say about this though down in the comments below. Do you want to see a KOTOR live action show or movie and do you think Leslie Headland should be at the head of it? Why or why not? I'm looking forward to reading those comments and responding to them over the next couple of days. Also while you're at it make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel if you're new. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.